Hey, what's going on, ladies and gents? We're going to be trying out Yai Miko for the first time ever. Let's just see how she does. This is going to be our first impressions of Yai Miko. And so far, she's here. There we go. And the team is kind of unusual. I guess it's always unusual. But here are her attack animations. And they look interesting. I think there's a certain distance where it just stops. Now, I wonder if it hits just at the end of it or it hits like the entire thing. And I just realized the volume's pretty low. All right. All right, that's pretty cool. And then we got the dashes. Oh, you can dash backwards too. If you don't press anything. Oh, that's sick. Okay, I'm just gonna have him up for, for fun, I guess. And then we can do the triple dash. Okay, that's so sick. Actually, it doesn't do that bad. There we go. We're level 80 out of 80. Uh, 71, 152. Pretty good ratios, actually, with electro damage, which is pretty nice. We've got the Kagura's variety on her. Uh, this is her weapon of choice. So they got two piece Shimanawa and two piece of the Thundering Fury. Makes sense with all eight on the talents. Now I want to try the ultimate here. Okay. The 20 for one of the things, right? Okay, the dashing is kind of slow. It is kind of slow. But look at that. It just... The passive damage is insane. What? What? Okay, wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. The passive damage is insane, no? Okay, let's try this again. Just let them do that. Look at that, it hit 7k. With a crit, of course. Alright, let's do, use our ultimate here. Okay, okay. I, You know what? I see you, Mihoyo. I see what you're doing. You know, you're making these look really, really good. But it might just be the weapon, okay? It might just be the weapon. I'll be the judge. I'll be the judge. Alright, but I do like her dashes. It just kind of is slow. So I'm not quite sure if there's like some sort of animation cancel for that. I don't know. So far, she's awesome. Definitely cool. Now, if I just leave this, she, it's just an auto turret. It's just gonna do all the work for me. I could just stand here. And then uh, once my ultimate is up, I could uh, use it. But as I see, the ultimate takes so long to come back. It, it makes sense because of how powerful it is. But it just takes forever. Okay, you should finish them off, right? No? Not quite, but it's so good. All right, there we go. All right, I do want to see some of her talents and stuff like that. Um, we've got a cooldown reset and an increase in damage for every point of elemental mastery. She has 105 right now. Not too bad. Um, her charge attack is pretty good as well. It's just this is actually pretty insane. I didn't expect it to hit as much as it does. It's really good. And every Thunderbolt does more damage. That's so cool. The, 90, the, the cooldown is 22 seconds. 22 seconds. As, wow. Wow. That's that's kind of a lot. And the Constellations. Uh, yeah, this is going to be pretty good for Restoration. Is there nothing to reduce the cooldown? Nothing to reduce the cooldown. It's insane. But yeah, that's gonna be it for the, you know, Yaimiko first impressions. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, like this video, subscribe to the channel as well. Let me know what you guys think of Yaimiko and if you summoned for her or are going to be summoning for her. And I'll see you guys in the next video so far. I'll give Yaimiko a thumbs up, personally. <laughs> yeah, see you guys.